And now I have a little bit of uh, news to bring you today, um, which is uh, bittersweet, sad, but also happy for me. Um, I have now decided that the time is right for me to move on from Radio 2. I'll reach the end of my current contract in March. And so at that point, I will be uh, moving on from Radio 2. Nothing stays the same forever. It has been a tremendously happy time for me here. I've made so, so many friends. I've worked with many, many wonderful colleagues but uh, I feel that after 45 years as it's been of full-time broadcasting on BBC Radio of some sort or another it is time for change uh, and I really must stress that this is entirely my decision my decision entirely however some new opportunities have come up and I would like to continue my career in just a slightly different way if that is possible in the next few years we'll be revealing the details of those opportunities in a little while but uh, in the meantime I'll always be tremendously proud of my association with the BBC and in particular with uh, Radio 2 I've been here quite a long time now and uh, it possibly is time to move over and let somebody else have a go I would like to thank absolutely everybody who's helped to make the mid-morning show the success it is and in particular of course you the wonderful radio 2 listener couldn't do it without you of course we will have many weeks together before the end of march including a fabulous month of piano room sessions which i'm looking forward to hugely so uh, maybe you'll be able to stay with us for all that and we'll be uh, enjoying some happy times still together here on Radio 2. But as I say, uh, we do have to move on, all of us, and the time for me is absolutely right now. So, that said, we get back to work, and uh, oh, this will take me back to many of the Eurovisions that I attended. I went to my first Eurovision in 1988 for the BBC, and uh, here we are this year in Liverpool it's going to be Gina G won it for us oh so many years ago I was there I enjoyed this and I will sing along with it too it's Gina G who are just a little bit (laughs) 